here. Isn't that right, Morty? <gasps> or shall I say, father? Oh, oh you nasty, God. lying, little world-ending perf. <laughs> What's up people, welcome back to Freaky Nap Live. My name is Dinesh. Today we'll be watching Rick and Morty episode number 4 of season 5. It's called Rick Dependent Spray. Rick Dependent Spray. It's like Independence Day, but I guess everybody is depend upon Rick Spray. What is Rick Spray? I don't know. Let's find out. If you're not subscribed to my channel, please hit the subscribe button. If you want to watch the full length reaction videos of this episode and the, all the other episodes, reactions that I do, you can check out my Patreon, help support me over there. What happened in the previous one? The previous one was just like, meh, it was okay. Uh, it was not up to the level, I would say. It was it was okay. I mean, if they would have casted Don Cheadle as Planetina, that would have been awesome. Captain Planet, motherfucker. Morty broke his heart again. I think the previous time Morty was in love was in the episode where the plane crash happened. He was trying to reset his life, like make a save point and then come back to it. And he found a really nice girl, had a very good relationship. But, uh, you know, his dad, Jerry, pressed the button thinking of it is a TV remote. So yeah, Morty has no luck in terms of love. And I think that's why he's gonna become Rick one day. Alrighty, hit subscribe and without any further ado, let's jump into this. We're gonna start in 3, 2, 1, go. Mom, we're gonna miss the movie. <laughs> oh, his mother is back at the hospital. Hours, I don't wanna hang out at the stupid horse hospital. The stupid horse stupid. hospital puts dinner on your table. Wouldn't kill you to take an interest. <laughs> That's a breeding mount. The nurses use it to collect reproductive material. Don't put your hand in. Oh. Uh-oh. He's not gonna put the hand in, that's for sure. He's gonna put some, something else. Okay, let's go see this latest piece of Marvel shit you kids are jizzing over. Yeah, uh, about time. <laughs> oh, oh. So what do you mean, like Endgame or Eternals? What are you talking about? Or Black Widow? No, no, seriously, I I'm very interested in, in your work. <laughs> Did he guard the machine at home? You know that race of underground dwelling cannibal horse people that we're always fighting? Yeah, the chuds. W w what about them? <laughs> the chuds. <laughs> I've been to use against them. So I got this barrel of horse semen from your mom's hospital, and uh -huh. I'm just gonna, you know. Oh shit, what if. Horses. Guess I should test it and make sure oh, it's. Make sure it's what? Horse semen, obviously. Okay, but it says. There's gonna be Morty. Morty semen in there. Do you even ask mom if you could have this? Morty, if I wanted to steal horse semen, I'd. Yes, I asked her. <laughs> Here. Why don't you trust labels? All right, fine. I won't test it. God damn, your generation. Oh, should have tested it. Should be safe, though, since the semen itself is, you know, also inhuman. Here we go. Uh. What did you give birth to? <laughs> what? Is that a, a big giant sperm? Okay. What? What happened? The sperm, Morty. They're super monsters. <laughs> Blame myself. Unless there was something about the sperm I didn't know. Are you? Oh, of course. Mess with me? What? Mess with you? How? You like trying to get me to say something? Morty, I have no idea what you're talking about. What if he's really? But then, then it's your fault. Why do you say something? <laughs> Maybe he's not. He was not trying to get something out of Morty's head. Alrighty. I thought maybe he knew what Morty did to it and now he's messing up with Morty. But now, this scene. So, because there was horse semen mixed with human semen, it make it, the sperm became monsters, a giant floating monsters killing people with teeth. Dad, what the hell is going on? Beth, sweetheart, can you give me a minute? I'm trying to steer around the bodies of our neighbors. <laughs> that felt like Gene. <laughs> Rick's fault. It's space sperm. What? Yeah, what? space sperm. I I've seen them before, but ne ne never like this. Space sperm? Sperm from space. Very impressive verbal <laughs> forensic work. <laughs> How big are space? Don't answer that. Damn, they must Don't be answer that. <laughs> oh. Exactly, look at the size of the sperms. How big are space dicks? Uh -oh. oh, saved by the president. You want me to keep the secret of where these things came from? Yes, technically it's a lie, but I messed up and I'm embarrassed because it's, you know, science. No problem. I Morty messed up. 
Okay, cool. Thanks, Morty. I thought that'd be a harder sell. You did a shit. <laughs> Dwelling on it isn't gonna help, you know? Am I right? Sometimes you just gotta wipe it off, toss it in the trash, and head back to study hall. Uh, uh, I'm not getting the metaphor, but I'll... <laughs> space sperm? Jesus, how big a space Same page <laughs> club. <laughs> Either you caused this mess, or it's those godforsaken horse people that dwell underground. Chuds. That's them. Chuds. Morty, you've always been a straight shooter. You can't prove that! Wait, what? <laughs> Is this your grandpa's fault? Here's what I know, sir. This is the greatest country on earth. It invented apple pies and lasers. Mm, keep talking. And that sperm, <laughs> we don't know nothing about it. Then the Chuds just got themselves a war. And uh, uh, this is Professor Shibubu, the world's leading expert. Professor Shibubu? If my calculations are correct, they have gathered here. Why would the sperm go to the Grand Canyon? America's G spot. Why are you looking at me like the answer is obvious? It's through the line over there. It's America's G spot. Curious, are we in middle school? You think sperm are instinctively heading for America's? Don't high road us later. It's where they went. <laughs> Luckily, I was able to secure a specimen. Now, obviously, they, our first oh, shit. DNA and figure out what these beautiful creatures are. Oh, why? Morty, ah! Are you out of your mind bringing an armed sperm in here? They can't hold guns. The boy literally never lies. <laughs> oh, he trusts. He trusts Morty. What are people going to do? <laughs> Complain we made the canyon grander? Jerry, we're... <laughs> yeah. The Grand Canyon is going to be the Grand Grand Canyon. I'm sending my best men with you. And women. It's a fine suggestion, but I doubt their leader will be a sexy queen that needs to be kickboxed. 100% male marine. Hey, gentlemen's bet. Which of these background marines do you think will last the longest? I'm not betting on <laughs> human lives, Rick. All of these people are going to survive, but obviously that guy the longest. Yeah, he's my yeah. pick, too. Because <laughs> he's so calm and he's, he's like meditating. meditating through turbulence. <laughs> I bet if something mm -hmm. fell, he'd like catch it without opening his eyes. Totally. Exactly. throw something at him? I got a pencil somewhere. <laughs> He died the no. I thought it was going to die the first, but us. no. Oh, oh, oh that's shit! So unexpected. Sperm uses tools. Time to fly! What happened to that ninja? Oh shit, Morty's alone. Moving. So cool. Not even a scratch. Okay, <laughs> totally. We just took a fat L, and what we need is a fat P. A plan. I take the lead. Up the hey. Please, one person draws the plan. <laughs> uh oh. What the hell are we calling them? <laughs> Fine, I'm dying, so I got pierced by a sperm. Morty's alone again. Well, easy there, little guy. It's okay. It's okay. Is it Morty's sperm? Do you know you came from me? I'm Morty. I'll call you Sticky. Because you're sticky and, and you're stuck. Oh. Oh, Step okay. aside, Morty. It's okay. You don't gotta do this. Let him go. That's his kid. Morty, don't f with me. What the hell's going on with you? The others are released. Holy sh! He, he can smell caves? I'm not trying to smell anything. The whole planet's a dorm room trash can. <laughs> Sir, Rick Sanchez has gone dark. I knew we couldn't rely on him. Well, maybe the pilot got too horny as they approached America's vagina. If you're gonna hang out in my war room, you can't just make snarky comments. At least do something useful, like Jerry. Right to the top, just the he, way he, he likes, likes giving people water, right? In one of the episodes, we got to know that he likes, he, he dreamt about giving people water. I do. That's right, me, the girl. Generally, <laughs> what do sperm want? The same thing as a lumberjack in the morning or a fox at night. Pants. Eggs. Pancakes. Eggs. You want to control giant? <laughs> what do sperm hunt? Eggs. Exactly. And, and what would happen if we enlarged one? They'll head right for it. Get MIT on the phone and <laughs> get this guy a Nobel Prize. Why? It was summer idea. That's actually very true. That happens a lot. Did, no. You got kids? The battlefield is my family. That's so Freaking cool. Badass. <laughs> Mom. Blazon, you don't have to do this. It is my destiny. <laughs> He's right, Morty. It's the price of being Blazon. Let him do his thing. <laughs> Blood for blood, cream for cream. Ah. Oh no, I can't reach that. What? Idiot. What? They're comfortable. You... Ah. Oh, that'll do it. I'm worm food. Morty, find my wife. Tell her I wasn't wearing her thong. That's a photocopy of Sports Illustrated swimsuit model Kathy Ireland. It's, it's my wife. Hold that picture up so we can have sex one last time. Okay, okay, you guys need to leave. What? What did he just say? I, I know how to s myself. 
I know how to suck myself. Oh shit, got eaten by spunks. He didn't even buy us any time. Get ready for some fireworks. Uh oh, those are smart spunks. Oh, oh, gross. This is the first time I've ever regretted being taken alive. Wait, we need it to create our army. Well, you need more than that, dummy. You need a horse. Oh. No, they need a Morty. Here. Isn't that right, Morty? Uh. Or shall I say, father? Oh, Morty, you my nasty, lying, God. little, world-ending perv. <laughs> <laughs> what was it like? Fantastic. <laughs> Rick, I'm sorry. I, I just thought maybe I... <laughs> it's just like that right Armageddon, I realize that's on me. Yeah, not exactly accepting apologies while I'm stuck here as handjob solo. This is a handjob solo. <laughs> How many millions went to their graves for you hurling themselves into the void only to discover a grody sock or carefully folded landing strip of toilet paper? How do you know oh. all this? Oh, honey, yeah. because we're the very essence of you. Rick, do something. <laughs> <Got it. laughs> what, what can Rick do? What, what did you do? I got out of your eye line. Oh, Good. No. Oh, oh. <laughs> yes, the end is near. But no, no, no. My, my, my sperm friend is here. <laughs> oh, he has you trick. Can't beat me. No, streaky. <laughs> Damn, that's some quintessential underdog shit. I should have told you the truth, Rick. Let's yeah. save the world first. Now reset those nukes and let's turn this canyon into a canteen. The earthquakes in Arizona? <laughs> no, there's a giant egg. Where did we find the giant egg, though? They're heading for Vegas, which does track on many levels, but... <laughs> um, hello? Aren't you forgetting someone? A yeah. good point. Big thanks to the cast of Cirque du Soleil's Zoomanity for the impressive and erotic routine. Mr. President. Well, no thanks to you. We're luring the sperm with a... It was a summer idea. A human egg? W where did you get it? Glad you asked. It's your granddaughter's. So at least you contributed something to this. Mr. President, it's Morty. It's my sperm. It's all mine. What? I'm a dirty little perverted maniac. I spent a week pleasuring myself with animal equipment and my sperm got turned into monsters on accident because I kept lying about it because I was ashamed. You said, man, we were all 14 once, but it's called self-control. <laughs> You'll be making a giant... Monster? What is incest that? Incest baby. What? Who told you that? What? We're about to make a giant incest <laughs> baby. <laughs> It'll take 30 minutes. What? Why? That's how long every space launch takes. No one realizes it because they only show you the last 10 seconds. <laughs> Help me out here. Hey, it was your idea, right? Uh... No need to panic, everyone. I have a simple solution. What? See you all in hell. Did he just kill himself? I don't see how that's going to hell. Form a perimeter. God damn, okay. I always knew your hormones would cause a world war between humans and cannibalistic <laughs> horse people. I just didn't know it would be like this. I can't change my nature. What are you? Look at Iron Man. That actor was an animal in the 90s, literally waking up in bushes. His agent had to catch him with a butterfly net. Son oh, good. Robert Downey Jr. Comeback story. Grandson's fault. You slept with my daughter. I did? Oh, shit, I did. Uh, forgive me, your chudness. When, when did that happen? You come to the kingdom of chuds for forgiveness? Yes. Chuds don't forgive humans. Chuds eat human. Not the bones, oh no. Father, <laughs> stop this at once. Princess Ponietta. You can't. Ponietta. I, I love him. What? <laughs> right, I, I love you too, Princess Ponietta. No, he don't. He don't. Chud, Rick is a human and age inappropriate. Then you leave me no. Rick is a human. Rico is the father of my child. I have an heir. I have a substance abuse problem. <laughs> Last thing this world needs is a giant incest, baby. <laughs> And let a single spur get through to that egg. Honey, let the men handle this. I think we know a thing or two about it. And then the man did not handle it properly. Ready for all of the responsibility with none of the credit. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, bum race. Can't stop them. We don't have the manpower. What about horsepower? What about woman power? They need us. Let's do this. Chuddly duddly ho ho ho. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of spawns in um, on the I promise to use condoms Vegas. even when it's butt stuff. Okay, we have a lot to talk about tonight. TMI, Summer, TMI. Is this 
your heart? But if you functions as a Just don't eat it. Ask you again. Is this your heart? <gasps> More Thank God he did not eat it. Thrown away, Rick. The egg is mine! Sticky the incest baby! No! Sticky! <laughs> We got a heartbeat. Screw that. That's a human life. And this is an election cycle. <laughs> uh oh. You were with my husband Blazon when he died. <laughs> Please tell me. Was he wearing my thong? And he was trying to suck himself. I hope he was wearing it. Always be honest. Sometimes it will hurt people. Sometimes it will help. He was wearing it. Ew, that gross animal pig. <laughs> so, trying to boil this all down. <laughs> what was he trying to do? Report. Shut up, Morty. I got my own epilogue. Oh, Rico. <laughs> epilogue. <laughs> Prove it. It's too meta. Uh, okay. Okay. Oh, Calm I down. love kissing those big old horse teeth. It's no. like licking tile. <laughs> God, it's wonderful. <laughs> oh, my fucking God. You don't. Have to, you know, r raise it? Nah, they're ready to go right out of the box. Cool, cool. Right out of the box? Right out of your vagina. Care of yourself, Rick. Yep, same. <laughs> so there's a horse, Rick. No? That was easy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this was a huge load of episode. So what happened to the last sperm? Like, uh, Sticky, he got into egg, made the incest baby, and went to space. With the with the pyramid. Houston, permission to open the starboard panel. Permission granted. Oh, Firing yeah. breach now. Sometimes staring back at Earth makes me think about the people I left behind. Okay. My wife, the son she had to anchor me there. I tried to be a parent, I really did, but I've come to find I'm only suited to be a spaceman. The nicest part of being up here is there are no reminders of the guilt I sometimes feel about abandoning my family. Wait, there's something big. It's, it's coming right at you! Oh, shit! No, you can't be real. Explore it. What is it? What the hell do you see? It's see? an incest, baby! Explore it. Explore it. Are you there? Hey, no! not gonna miss that guy. Right? So dramatic. Did you get a It's okay, did you? Hey, let's watch the inside of the episode. Oh, how this is allowed to be on TV, to be <laughs> Morty, you dirty little doggy. The one thing that I was excited about with Giant Sperm was I wanted to see like the sort of old school Jumanji sequence where people had to ride sperm. <laughs> you think I've learned this lesson over 20 years, but it's like, yeah, don't start with like, oh, well, we know one thing's for sure, they're fighting giant sperm. <laughs> Why do you know that for sure? Now, guess what you don't know for sure? Why are they doing it and what's important about it? And then you the story <laughs> Well, this episode was tricky for a while. Dan didn't want to hinge an episode on a lie. The boy literally never lies. The episode starts with the heaviest amount of contrivance in the, in the world. The audience knows something that Rick doesn't, and Morty knows it, and we know that Morty knows it, and we know that Morty didn't tell Rick. I blame myself, unless there was something about this firm I didn't know. We did many, many rewrites to and try to work it so it's both maybe, there. Seek. Maybe Rick is doing that on purpose. And like at that time, I really thought Rick is doing that on purpose. He knows what Morty did, and now he just it is doing it. Just to make At the end, Sticky fertilizes the egg. Uh huh. Summer's, Summer's egg. egg. So now Morty and Summer have a baby. And a massive insect. Which is in space. Is and then space, space bats will see that. Um. <laughs> <laughs> I guess. It, that that happened. Yeah, that, that happened. happened. Well, guys, that was this episode of Rick and Morty. It's it's funny how. The president trusts Morty more now instead of Rick, because in the in one of the episode of the previous season, uh, he won't even take a selfie with Morty. But now he's like the boy never lies, but he did. He did. Poor Morty just used the machine for once, made giant sperm monsters, and who were going to Las Vegas <laughs> because that's America's G spot. Huh, okay. You know what I really enjoyed it. It was random. It was very random and that's what it's about. That's that's the that's the real fun. And random things. And that ninja guy who was like totally anime. Rick and Morty were even like, oh he's cool, he's just meditating, he's so silent, he's so calm, even in turbulence. Yeah, that guy wore a thong, got stabbed by himself and then tried to suck himself. So yeah.
Well, guys, that was this episode of Rick and Morty. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe to my channel. Let's do our first 2,000 subscribers as soon as possible. And yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow. Goodbye, guys. Take care.